Praise to you, O Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. Christ became obedient for us, even to death, dying on the cross. Therefore God raised him on high, and gave him a name above all other names. Praise to you, O Lord Jesus Christ, King of endless glory. come to this moment, this place where we discover the reality of God's love for us, where we are overwhelmed by all that he has done, by the goodness, by that complete ability of Jesus to, to say yes. Even though so often in our lives, we say no. We refuse his love. We refuse to admit or to accept who he has called us to be. He looks at us and all he sees is the gift of his creation. All he sees is what he has made us to be. He knows the ways that we've mucked things up. He knows the mistakes that we have made. And yet through it all he loves. Through it all he sees the potential. He sees what he has created, what he has shaped. And he knows that if we but open ourselves to his love, if we but stop running, if we just allow ourselves to be held in that embrace, if we allow him in truth to heal us, then the palms that we hold the palms that were such a symbol of, of victory, such a sign of, of what was possible, the victory that we acclaimed when Jesus came into Jerusalem on that first Palm Sunday, the victory of the crowds who shouted out their hosannas, who cried out to God, who wanted the Lord to indeed come as their Messiah, come as the one who would bring freedom, who would bring relief. And through all this, we continue to cry out as we acknowledge that he has won that victory. He has freed us from our sins. But we have a part. We have a role to play in all this. And that is to accept. That is to embrace. That is to allow his love to do his work on us to stop running away, to, top, to stop claiming that I can do this in my own steam, under my own strength, and to admit I can't. I can't do it. And so, Lord, today, as we look upon you on the cross, as we see your love manifested so clearly for us, Lord, help us to stop running to stop denying the work that you want to do in us and to accept your gift and your grace today as a sign of your love and your life for us. Amen.